I've been wanting to catch a fish here. This is where I was uh, for a short period of time in my last video. I got taken out by a wave. I kind of just had to call this spot quits. These black bass should swim around in schools. So hopefully where there's one, you can find another. There we go. There we go, guys. Oh, lost it. So let's sink back down if we can. Oh, they're down there. There we go. Oh, you guys. Oh my God, you guys. That is a friggin' lean cod, you guys. I just watched that thing come up and slam that. It's taken, oh my God, my first lean cod, you guys. Oh, I could not, this is why I came here. I want this fish. Wow. My, oh, I've never had a lean cod on you guys. That is absolutely exciting look at that you can see it from here it's supposed to be 22 inches or bigger to keep i gotta make my way down here oh my god you guys that is a beautiful fish holy crap that thing actually came to the surface for this that is way beyond 22. oh my god i cannot believe it you guys we gotta watch these waves real quick so i hope i can keep this fish on oh I could not be any happier right now, you guys. Oh my God. That is a bucket list fish for me right there. Wow. Oh my God. Yes, this is why I came out here, you guys. Holy smokes. Look at that thing. Look at that thing, it's hardly even its lip anymore. I almost lost this fish, you guys. That is definitely a 22 incher. I mean, if I cannot lose this fish on my way up here, I gotta make it back to where I was so we can get this thing officially measured. All right, I got my measuring tape, which probably should have been on me, but I did veer away from where I was fishing. So we need to be 22 inches. Oh, the teeth on that thing. You guys, we are 23 almost 24 inches and it's actually a bit longer than that. All right, yes! Oh my God. Get the camera on for that one. Show you guys in here. There it is, you guys. My very first lean cod. And that is a darn good looking one too. You still see the little sea lice on it. Oh my God, you guys, my bucket list fish right there. So I think we're gonna find a spot that I can get this guy in one of these pools around here. I do not have a stringer. So I think what I'm gonna do is use some 30 pound. I'm just gonna do ah, slimy hands, guys. So you guys, I would, you know what, maybe we should. No, I'm gonna eat them. We're gonna eat them. So what I was doing, hopefully the wind doesn't cut out this audio. You can see this long channel that goes in through here. And for that lean cod, I threw out, I can see this rock <clears throat> outcropping underneath that white water right now. And so my idea was, was to try and throw it to the tip of that and just slowly work that thing back. And oh man, I wish I would have had the camera facing down for you guys. So you could have seen that ling cod come up and grab that. But I'm going to try casting down in the same area. Ugh. What's crazy is you see where I'm climbing right now. And you know that this is what it looks like uh, underneath the water. It's just a continuation of all this. So, I mean, right here, I don't really know how deep it is, but for all I know, 
it could be one of these 30 foot drops like that that goes straight down so it's kind of hard to tell sometimes working with this wind it's really a pain in the butt a lot of the times you feel the tap on the line before you uh feel the tug rock yeah come on Let's see if we can get behind it That one does not want to come back, guys. It's our fish catcher. I need that one back. There we go. Yeah, we got it. We probably bent out the hook. Yeah, we should push that back in. So it's probably a big, well, it is a big no-no. Because -no, obviously it's going to make your hooks dull. But a lot of the times if I'm far from my, my gear, I'll just push it back in and hope Hope that it doesn't cost me a fish. A little bit better. I'll try and throw it to that point and get it to sink right in between that rock point and this rock point. That wind's kind of grabbing my line and it's really dragging in my gear in a direction I don't want it to be. We're likely to uh, get wrapped up around the rocks. fish what do we got what do we got black bass oh. another black bass whoa 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 there you go oh, this is amazing out here right now it's windy but it's not cold yet into the rocks there you go sink baby you see that bow in my line just kind of been another identifier for me when it's like this either i feel the tap or i see that bow go away really quick and either i'm hitting a rock or the bottom or a fish has got it fish oh that's a that's a good one especially off this cliff not a bad fish I gotcha. Unless you guys know that is a black rockfish. There you go, dude. It's a drop. Another fish on. <laughs> Another black bass. These are all some, uh, some nice fish, though. Oh, quit wiggling. I'll let you go. Her plunk. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad I came back to this place. Rock. Ah, we shouldn't have gotten that close. Oh, that's my fish getter. Come on. Who? Oh. All right, you guys. Well, we're tied up with the new one. I'm gonna go with this nice plum purple with some uh, blue flake sparkle in there and see how that does. I want to bring you guys a little closer to the action. Yeah, I'm going to go down there. Let's try it. Let's see if we can get purple to be as effective, if not more, than that chartreuse there we go here we go it's another lean oh 
you guys, it's another lingcod. No way. Two fish in one day. Wow. I got you. There you go. Look at that. Two lingcod in one day. You guys can't see that. Whatever. Ugh. Much smaller than our other guy, but man, how cool. There you go, buddy. Go make some babies. Make lots and lots of babies. All right, you guys, so I came to check out this new area, which is pretty much at the end of that channel that I was fishing. But I wanted to stop and take a quick minute to say thank you guys for watching this video. And if you're not subscribed to the channel already and you like what you're seeing right down there at the bottom of the screen, I think it's, oh, dude, it's one of those little icons right there is the subscribe button. If you guys don't want to subscribe, but you do like what you're seeing, please show me a little bit of love and hit that like button. I'm going to move right over here and uh, we're going to fish off this little cliff and see if we can't find something more in this calm water back here. Alright guys, first things up since we're in a, it's a tighter area, maybe a little more shallow, I'm going to just go with this uh, little small grub that we've got here. See what happens. Alright, this is where do not do not want to fall in. I would actually like to make my way over there so I can fish this channel out that way. Oh, oh, first cast, you guys. Holy sh! Are you kidding me? Why did I have to catch a link cod here? Oh my god. Oh, I don't know if I can get it, you guys. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, this is not good. Not good, guys. Holy smokes. Oh, we'll get it. We're gonna get it. Ugh. Oh, sorry, fish. Sorry. Did not mean to be. You guys, first cast, are you kidding me? Oh, it's going to cut me up. I just went from catching no lean cod before to there's number three. Look at those that sea lice on there. All right, well, I hope you're going to be okay with this drop. I'm sorry, I did not think I was going to catch you. Are you kidding me? Oh! I don't know if anything can top that. Maybe get in another one. Oh! This is like the coolest day of fishing ever. I uh, did not like to have to drop that fish. It's probably like 30 feet. Dang. Probably why it'd be better to get in here and work this. Holy smokes. Those things will cut you up too. You gotta be careful. <laughs> There we go. There we go. That feels like another good fish. That's another good fish, you guys. Holy smokes. Of course, it can't take line because I'm so tight on this thing right now. No way. That's going to be another ling, I bet. Another one. Wow. Ugh. Got 
break my reel, guys. Oh. You know that's another keeper, you guys. Holy smokes. <laughs> Woo! Can we get a measurement on you? Huh? Yeah, I'm not putting my hand in there. I don't have to. Oh, goodness. Wow, you guys. It's another beautiful fish. And back to the bottom. I am in fishing heaven right now oh my god i don't know what to say right now you guys i am so friggin stoked wow Yeah, 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 oh, oh, that's a bass. That one's a bass. Let's get you out of there, bud. That's, oh, man. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You're gonna rip up my hand. I'm just, just gonna throw you back in the water. Little black bass. Celery. You got it, you got it. Woo! See him swimming down to the bottom. Oh. I guess we should leave the drag loose until I need to tighten it up. Bring that line down. It's stuck on the rocks. Fish, fish, woo! You're not the same guy, are you? Nope, nope. Ah! Just another into, oh geez, he's oh. Got plenty of these. All right. Perfect. See you. I wonder what a fish is thinking on its way down. <laughs> There's got to be a bunch of fish. It's 
hanging out right down there. Just kind of letting it work back to me. Fish. Wow. <laughs> Non-stop action, you guys. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. There you go. You know, you know the drill. That's a good landing. Well, definitely found the black bass. Just hanging out back here. See if we can do it again. See how fast we can catch one. I don't know, that last one was pretty quick. There we go. There it is. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. All right, plenty of black bass. We've, we're no stranger to you guys. Do you not like when people touch your lips? There you go. Another good fish. There you go. That is another tank, you guys, my goodness. I don't even know if that thing is gonna be able to come up here. Ugh. Ugh. Oh my God. You guys, this fish is too big. Jeez Louise. You guys, that thing was huge. Oh my God. Wow. I can't even be mad right now. Can't even be mad right now. Oh. I am really hoping you guys were able to see that one on the camera. If not, that really sucks because if that other caught, link caught I caught was just over 24 inches, that one by far had a few more inches on it to where even if I tightened up my drag all the way, as you can see, that wasn't working. I was having to try and hand line it up. And uh, when it was probably about a half, not halfway up, uh, it either just broke off or it either got cut off on the, uh, the rocks. So lesson learned, maybe I'll start fishing with a slightly heavier line or maybe try and get a little bit lower down in the water. But this spot, as you guys can see, is putting out fish and it is making for one hell of a day, man. Well, that like feels I, like a good fish. 
It's, a, it's shaking its head. Oh, don't get away from that rock. Get away from that rock. It's burning light. Link card. I don't even know how to sum up today's fishing besides absolutely insane. I couldn't leave here any happier today. In fact, I'm not even leaving. I'm, I'm calling it quits for this evening because it is starting to get dark out here, which means that I need to go find a place to crash out. Because as some of you guys probably know, when I come down here doing this, I'm usually sleeping in the back of this thing. So I've got it all set up. And as I brought up earlier, you guys, if you liked what you saw, please give this video a thumbs up. It helps me a lot and it actually goes a long way. Uh, until tomorrow, for those of you that are going to stick by and uh, watch the next video of day two, I will see you guys in the morning. And for the rest of you guys, I hope to see you guys down the road. Thanks for watching, guys.